叫黑丝裙。Parade Marshal, prepare for the national anthem. Good morning everyone and welcome to our 87th annual sunrise service. You will find the history of the service at the back of the program. Also the Earls Court brand, Pipe Band, Branch 65 are celebrating their 70th anniversary this year. For their service to the Legion, the community. Joining us today, among other dignitaries, dignitaries, we have Ontario Provincial Command President, Comrade Bruce Julian, and our District D Commander, Comrade Jay Burford. Now we are going to have a few words from Antoinette Sweeney, the manager of the Prospect Cemetery. In our cemetery, which is dedicated to Canadian and Allied veterans, we believe this is much more than a burial place. This section acts as a permanent memorial for future generations to become acquainted with their family and our country's history. This morning we remembered together the courage of the thousands who went into battle to secure our future. We are grateful for the bravery of all our veterans who so many years ago endured hardships to fear to fight in protection of the freedoms we enjoy today. Our thoughts and prayers are also with the many that are still fighting for freedom and democracy around the world. Without the strength and courage of our veterans, we would not be the country we are today. We owe you our tributes, our respect, and our gratitude. We thank you. Thank you. times before their deaths. The valiant ne'er taste of death but once. Shall we pray? Heavenly Father, creator of the universe and all that is therein, we thank thee as the giver of life and for maintaining us and sustaining us unto this day of remembrance. It is with grateful hearts and minds accompanied with thankfulness for the freedom we have to meet freely, to remember the sacrificial giving of our comrades in arms. Those who faithfully served our country unto their deaths, 
those who suffer disablement, long-term injury, physically, emotionally enlarged. Yes, we remember and we experience the freedom we have right now to meet unmolested by any authority in all of the conflicts that have been going on from World War One. Comrade President, I'd like to uh, be attached. Flags can be used as a mark of distinction, rank, nationality, and should convey a message to the units operating under it. The present Canadian national flag is not the one many of us older vets wore allegiance to, but we would never let the old flag down, no matter what it was. Dedication of the Wreaths by Dr. Norman Gunn.